Hi students, how are you all? Uh, today we are going to discuss about distance and displacement. Distance and displacement, the idea is very easy. Um, let us draw something to understand that. Let us consider that this is our home. This is your home and this is your school. So from home to school, do you think from your home to school, the road is complete straight? Never. Never. We find our road like this. Say this is the actual road from your home to your school. From your home to school, this is the actual road. The actual path by which you have to walk or bicycle or by bus, car, whatever you say. From your home to school, this is the actual road by which you have to travel. We call it distance. Yes, we call it distance. From home to school, that straight line, that direct straight line is called displacement. Displacement. So this is distance, this is displacement. Distance is the actual road or the actual path by which we are traveling. The actual road or the actual path by which we are traveling. That is called distance and that is called displacement. To, I will suggest you to find the displacement. Always remember this formula. Initial position to final position. That will help you to find the displacement. Initial to final. Initially you are at home. Now finally you are in school. So initial to final, that is, this is the displacement. But this actual path which we are covering, that is distance. Now, say, from my home to school, the distance is 5 km. 5 km. But in the straight way, this is little less than this. Say this is 3.5 meter. Sorry. 3.5 kilometer. So this is 5 kilometer. That is the distance. And displacement is 3.5 kilometer. Now, from home to school, home to school, what is the distance covered by me? Distance covered by me is 5 kilometer. Yes, distance covered by me is, is 5 kilometer. What is the displacement covered? Displacement is always initial to final. Remember, initial to final. So, what is the initial to final? That is 3.5. So, this is 3.5 kilometer. Where is it? Now, say your school got over. Now, you have raised your home again. That is from home to school and then again school to home. Home to school, school to home. So, what is the distance now? What is the distance from home to school? 5 km. School to home. Another 5 km. I hope you got it. Let us repeat it again. From home to school, 5 km. School to home, another 5 km. So 5 plus 5, that is 10 km. So 10 km is my distance. What is my displacement? My displacement. As I told you, displacement. The formula is initial to final. Now, you have started from home. Home to school. And again school to home. I told you, home to school, school to home. So, what is my initial position? Home. What is my final position? That is also home. Initial and final, both are home. So, initial is here. Final is also here. So initial to final. Can you find the distance between initial to final? No. Because initial is also home. Final is also home. Since initial and final positions are same. So my displacement is zero. Okay. So distance you are covering. Distance you are covering from home to school and then school to home. But displacement, yeah, obviously. Uh, from home to school, school to home. But you here, when you are here, initial position is home, final position is also home. So, initial position is home, final position is also home. 
so initial and final both are same when both are same that is displacement is zero so this is the complete idea of distance and displacement thank you